today I will cover this uh, topics and I'll start with the company vision. Our company vision actually, uh, we are a, a manufacturing company and our vision is to be a lean and happy organization. And how do we, uh, how do we want people to remember us? It is to be a lean and happy customer, lean and happy organization. And to achieve this target, we have uh, values. Our first value is we must have happy customers. And uh, the KPIs are very clear, safety, quality, cost, delivery, good engineering and good management. That's what our customer looks for. And our second value, we must have happy employees, teamwork, look at problems as opportunities, love your family, company and country, loyalty and honesty, and mutual respect. And then uh, if uh, one and two is aligned, then our shareholders will have uh, reasonable profit. Yeah? And uh, number four is happy public. And uh, we should do uh, CSR or corporate governance, corporate and social responsibility. So we have these four values. Happy customers, happy employees, happy shareholders, and happy public. Yeah? Our strategy is to, uh, to be not only strong in Thailand, we hope that uh, we can expand to China, India, and uh, be a strong Asian company. Thailand's car industry, I think uh, despite all the problems uh, we are seeing, the car industry in Thailand uh, is still uh, getting strong. Car production trend, 2010-2011, uh, this is to the month of uh, quarter one, eh? quarter one. Total is uh, 382,000 units 2010, 469,000 units 2011. So there is a significant growth. This is domestic. Domestic car sales. 166,000, 366,000. So the local domestic sale is very, very strong in Thailand. And this is a total car production trend. You can see that, uh, you know, despite the ups and downs, you can see that uh, the total production is still trending up in uh, Thailand. This is domestic car sales. Again, you can see that it is also steadily trending up. This strong trend that you see here is mainly due to the Eco car, the Nissan Eco car, the Ford Fiesta, the Mazda 2. So these are the cars now uh, getting popular in Thailand. A short market update. The Ford has a new assembly plant in Hemaraj. The plant is almost 70% uh, finished. The first model of the Ford Focus will be launched next year. Mitsubishi is building a new plant in Liam Chabang. And uh, this is quite interesting now. I think uh, Mitsubishi, is, there's news in the paper, is working with Nissan. So it's a potentially of combination of Nissan with uh, Mitsubishi in uh, new business in Thailand. Because uh, Nissan capacity is full already in the Bangna truck, so they have to look for more capacity. So they have to uh, you know, work without big investment, but how to expand their business. Suzuki, the new plant is also about 70% finished for the new eco car in uh, Hemorrhage. Uh, future projects. Uh, this month, the Brio is, is being launched, 2011, new eco car for Honda. The Ford pickup actually uh, is started to launch also in uh, May, Still soft, soft uh, launch, but I think the volumes will increase in June and July. 
the Nissan second eco car, the five door, is launched in July. The Mazda new pickup is also John launched in uh, July. Of course, uh, there's also another vehicle which is the Isuzu new pickup, which is launched in uh, September. Uh, financial summary. Uh, if you look at the financial summary, you will observe that the revenue has has gone down Q Q on Q. Uh, perhaps uh, you may like to know the reasons. The main reason for this is on the fourth quarter of last year, we invoiced two links. We invoiced about 450 million of two links last year. Two links or jigs basically is jigs about 450 million, which don't exist in uh, Q1. So that is the main reason. If, uh, so there's no actually a drop in the car production for Q1. It is actually basically the, the, uh, the toolings, no toolings were invoiced in uh, uh, Q1. Uh, and you can see the cross, gross, Gross profit uh, level is about the same. Percent gross profit is about the same, Q1, Q. Uh, if you compare, I think uh, if you look at the uh, situation between uh, last quarter and this quarter, it is, the trend is quite uh, in line, basically. And then I just want to put year on year uh, versus uh, Q on Q for just uh, easier uh, uh, analysis. You can see the trend is also quite uh, in line. The sale dropped 14%. The net profit, twelve uh, percent. Quarterly earnings. And uh, perform quarterly earning performance. The trend is still, you know, in line. Sales contribution by countries, I think still mainly Thailand, Malaysia, China. AH and AHP customer, AAT, Mazda Ford, Isuzu and TID, the same customer, because all supply to Isuzu, Nissan Moto, and uh, Nissan, these are the same customers, Toyota and others. Apico Forging, TRW, Auto Alliance, Ford Mazda, uh, TYM, TRW, T, T, uh, Toy, uh, Yamaha, Thai Yamaha, Getrek, America, Export, Getrek, Export, Dana, Thailand, Magna, Export to Amer Europe and America, and other customers. Apico Plastics, Yamaha, Ford Mazda, export to Australia, Johnson Controls for Thailand and General Motors, Honda, General Motors, Hino, and other customers. The utilization rate of our factories, Ayutthaya factory, which is our press operations, is almost full capacity now, is uh, full capacity. AHP Ayutthaya is steadily coming to full capacity with the launch of the Honda Eco car. So when the Honda Eco car runs full stream, this will be full capacity. AH Rayong is just starting for the, the T6, the Ford T6. So it's starting to, to produce now, starting to invoice uh, in the second quarter. Apico Forging, 
Matanakon is 80%, Apiko Forging, Liam Chabang, 